Hello, my young explorers. I've missed you and I came with a little activity for us to do together. I started with going on a nice little walk around my neighborhood, pick up some stuff in nature. I got, found some flowers here. We got little bits of pine cones, some rocks, sticks over here on the side, um, pine needles, of course. And I thought we would make some fun little sensory bottles. They can be really calming. I got this one right here. It's full of flowers and stuff in it. And you just kind of tip it. And you can watch them float to the top. And you can spin it and watch them float. So it kind of helps you calm down a little bit when your body's feeling really excited. I got this other one. I did some pine needles and a little bit of flowers in there. And this one's got sticks and rocks and pine cones. So it's a little bit louder. You, know, you shake it, it makes some, some sound. So I thought we could work on making one together. So you start with your bottle. I'm gonna pick a few things we wanna toss in there. How about we stick some flowers in? We'll make a nice calming one with the flowers. Just like that. Make some of these pink flowers here that I have. These ones are actually a little bit sticky. Maybe we could add, I don't know, a couple of these smaller pine cones to it. Just like that. All right, and then we have to add a little some water. So we're gonna fill up the bottle with water. And you fill it up all the way up to the top. And this is something you're probably going to have to have a grown-up help you with so that it, it doesn't get too messy. Here we go. All the way up to the top. And then we're also going to have our grown-up take a little bit of glue and put it around in the inside of the cap for your bottle. So that at, this way, when it dries, the cap stays stuck on and we don't lose the water and all of our fun nature stuff inside of it. We got this one, we can just tip it and watch as our flowers go. Just like that. So I don't have quite enough water to fill a second one, but why don't we throw something else in there? Um, what do you guys think? What do you, do you wanna do? The rocks? Oh yeah, definitely. Let's throw some rocks in there. That's gonna make it really fun. There we go. All right, what, what next do you guys want to do? Oh, you wanna do some flower petals? Okay, let's do some flower petals in here. One, two, three. Right, and let's pick one more thing to add to this sensory bottle. Oh, that's a great idea. The little pine cones can go in it too. Guys, have the best ideas. Maybe I have enough water, let's give it a try. Four. Look how all the items are kind of starting to float up to the top. Yeah, not quite enough, but we can cap this one up. I'll fill it up later and we'll we can still take a look and see how it goes. And you hear that sound? Mm, those are our rocks rolling around. So you guys can make your own bottles at home. All you gotta do is go out on a walk and find some great stuff in nature. And you have a bottle laying around and fill it up with your items. Pour some water in there and have your parents help you out. Looking forward to seeing you guys later.